Welcome back to another adventure. This one, we are going to the mountains and we are staying there for one night. We're gonna go do some backpacking out on a mountain lake in the great PNW. Let's get right into it. There's the pack. Packed all the way to the brim. Oh, let's do it to it, man. We got Alex driving me this time. Oh, well, passenger princess over here. How are we doing? <laughs> Should be a good little backpacking trip, man. First one of the summer, dude. We're starting late. I know, to the mountains. Here it is, September 10th. And this will be my first like legitimate backpacking trip in Washington this summer. It's a little bit of a late start, but better late than never. Introduce yourself to the people, man. Oh, shoot. <laughs> this is Alex. So, Alex, I met at Boeing. When I used to work direct for Boeing, I met this guy through basketball. And we just hit it up, man. We just got along really well right away. Now we're just always doing stuff like this together. So, yeah. He said he missed me a ton in Phoenix, so. I'm yeah, it's good to have him back. <laughs> good to have him back. So this will be a fun little backpacking endeavor, man. Let's do it. Let's get it. Just like that. We're to the trailhead, man. Oh. Gotta find space for these now. Away we go, onto the trail. All right, first water break. It's busy up here, man, passing 3,000 people already. Makes it hard to film, passing people every 10 seconds. <laughs> Hopefully that means it's not too packed at the lake, though. Yeah, they're all coming back. You guys camping up there? Mm -hmm. Damn. <laughs> Should be a good night, hopefully. I wish we could camp up there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, have a good one. We're camping Sunday night into Monday morning, and then we're hiking down and going to work. So, some call is crazy. Right. It's a little ambitious, but that's how you uh, get the spot to yourself, usually, it's on the off days. My pack is entirely too heavy, man. Somehow I packed way too much stuff for one night, but. Come on, man. <laughs> this is the reality of getting content, man. <laughs> Going up and down the trail a bit for the cool shots. Thanks for doing this for me, man. Yeah. <laughs> Alex is my film guy today. All right, ready? Perfect. That's for the reel, so it doesn't need to be as long. Okay. That's perfect, man. Thanks. I got a shot of it. I, I want it panned over a little bit. Oh yeah, dude. Try to keep you in the frame. It's nice having someone to take those shots for me, man. Usually I gotta set my tripod up, walk, process, walk man. up, walk back. And then if people are coming down the trail, it's a little awkward because you got your camera in the trail. <laughs> We've been hiking already for about about 40 minutes already. We've been going up this trail. I would say we're about halfway to the lake. We're making decent time. Yep, keeping good pace. It's crazy how busy it is still on a Sunday. This is probably the most popular hike near Seattle though, I'd imagine. I think so. I was like, what else is there? You got Pilchuck's pretty popular. I was gonna say Pilchuck. I was thinking Ledge might be more popular. I think it is. Yeah, Tiger Mountain. Do a little, do a little selfie. <laughs> There's the cameraman for the day. <laughs> what they pay me for? 
paying them the big bucks. Hey. Oh. Blow my knees out, dude. <laughs> <laughs> just land. Just, <laughs> just knees yeah, this one's still going. <laughs> <laughs> Straight up stairs, man. This is straight up just stairs, man. That's all worth it, right? <laughs> We're almost to the top of the ridge. And then we gotta hike down from there into the lake. So we're getting close. We've been going for an hour and 10 minutes now. It doesn't even feel like an hour and 10 minutes. No, the top's right here though. We're getting close to the top of the ridge. And then be the final stretch down to the lake. And then we're gonna jump right in. Mm -hmm. Cool off. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Still pretty warm out there. Made it to the ridge. Now let's get down to the lake, huh? Do a little swimming. What a view, man. Alex is already gun ho for the lake. <laughs> Look at this guy, already ready to go. Can you jump from there, you think, or not? Nah? You gotta get out a little ways. You gotta clear that like rock there. What a view, though, huh? <laughs> How is it? <laughs> That's perfect. Well done, man. <laughs> Heck yeah. This guy made it. Psych. Mobbed up here. Welcome. So we are all here now. The whole crew is here. And now I think we're going to have to jump in this lake, man. Cool off a bit. Let's do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. So clear. It's freezing, but it feels so good. Woo. Can't be this, folks. Beautiful summer day in Washington. After a long hike and jumping in the water, refresh up a bit. It's the best. But now I'm gonna get changed into some warmer clothes. And then we'll bring the chairs down to the lake, I think. And have some food, man. Get some grub in the belly. Oh, oh yeah. Not 
too shabby of a spot, man. Yeah, this will do. This will do just fine. That'll do, piggy. I feel like it was pretty heavy, man. It was probably close to, it was over 50, maybe 60 pounds. Uh -huh. Tuck and Robin was 70 pounds, but and it was a two-nighter, so I had clothes for two days, yeah. food for two days. Mine was probably 26, 27. Yours? Yeah. That's pretty light, light dude. Light, baby. To get that, to get your pack down to 26 pounds for an overnight, it's pretty light. Pretty light. That's the way to do it, though. Yeah. What a view though, huh? It doesn't even feel real. You're sitting out here, we're sitting. I like that. You can charge it full day. Pretty shit. Pretty Friday though. I wish I was. Oh man. Lynn, you excited for that? Nashville? Yeah. Or it's gonna look like it. But he also worked out. Works out a ton of stuff as well. But I think running now has helped to maintain weight. The sun is about to go behind these mountains. And that'll be it for the sun for the day. It's already gotten a lot colder with the sun going down. As you can tell, we got the hoodie, the beanie on, staying warm. Beautiful, beautiful views though. Same shoe except it was leather. Incredible. All right, Alex brought his little fishing pole, and apparently there's supposed to be some rainbow trout in this lake. So uh, Alex is gonna try his hand at catching one, maybe. What are the odds you think he'll catch one, man? Give it a one in a million. A <laughs> one in a million? <laughs> I'll take those odds. So you're saying we have a chance? Just telling me there's a chance. <laughs> Just look how beautiful this lake is right now. Absolutely gorgeous, man. Cannot beat views like this, man. Alpine lakes, it's the best. All right, man, show them how it's done. First cast of the trip, let's go. Godspeed on catching the fish, man. and then some little brook trout. Yeah, those are some beautiful fish, man. Nice. Some of the ones that he caught that day were so beautiful. Beautiful. And oh, yeah, baby. baby. Let's reel one home, huh? Yeah, let it sink down a little bit, and then you can start reeling in. Do what you feel, man. Do whatever feels good in the soul. I don't know if you can get much more peace than this, man. Yeah. Does it have a little bit of a drag on the spinner? Yeah. Almost feels like there's some weight on there, and you're like, oh, yeah. oh what is that? Dude? Oh, oh. <laughs> that tea is oh, what good. is that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, the sun's not shining, right? Yeah, it's they're usually more active, like right before, or like really early in the morning or in the evening before it gets dark. <laughs> there we go. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> For a little bit. I'm gonna take a few casts on here, dude. 
I'm biting out there. Yeah. That one they saw out here. That's the one I've seen close though. Yeah, that's the rock we stood on. Mm -hmm. The first one there. Mm -hmm. oh, it's always up there. Dude. Look at that guy way up there. <laughs> Still no luck on the fish, but we're trying. This lake is like pure glass now. I'm gonna take a break from fishing for now, get some more grub. Take in the sunset views, man. I'm poking around here earlier. Yeah, he's climbing up. See that right in the middle? This one close to us? Yeah, uh, this big guy right here, the top cut off. What is it, a blue jay? Oh, I see. Yeah, he's going That's up the tree right now. Alrighty, the sun is now setting. It's getting starting to get dark now. It's like a little, almost 7.30. So it looks a lot lighter on here than it does in real life. That is about the end of the daylight for the day. Alex is making some dinner. And then we'll head up the hill and make camp. Get settled in for the night. It's bending it out in nature. It's gonna be a glorious night. There's still so much sand on it from the Oregon trip. <laughs> and it's still wet, dude. We got dumped on on that trip. Got my sleeping pad. It has the foot pump. The foot pump's super nice because you just Gotta sit here and, and it pumps up. <laughs> and just like that, we have a pumped up sleeping pad. Pillows. And a sleeping bag. Yeah. And this will be home for the night. I need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Oh, how convenient. We'll see you guys in the morning. Yeah, buddy. All right, man. Get down safe. Let me know when you're down there. Yep. I'll probably see you tonight, huh? Let me know when you're back. Alright. All right.
Now time for the best part. Cheers. That's so, so good. lake until next time all right we're all packed up it's time to head back to the car it's a yeah. little bit before 8 a.m right now we got to go back to work back to work <laughs> for a half day so we're gonna get out of here so that's gonna conclude this video thank you guys so much for watching stay tuned for more adventures we'll see you in the next one peace